My name is Maria Mackin. Um, I work at the University of Rochester in Rochester, New York. I've been a nuclear technologist for many years now. Um, a typical day in nuclear cardiology, a patient would come in. Um, they would check in. One of our nurses would take them back, interview them, put an IV into one of the veins of their arms. So you would get a, um, an injection after the nurses put the IV in. You would get an injection of a small amount of a radio um, tracer. We wait about 40 minutes, bring you into the camera room, and we'll take pictures um, of your heart at rest. And we'll review the images. If we think there's something that should be there or uh, whatever, we'll call it our cardiologist to look at the images to see if you should go on it for a near stress test. And once you go on for your stress test, um, it could be a pharmacological stress or it could be walking on the treadmill or it can be a combination of both a rest and or a stress on the treadmill and the pharmacological stress. Once that's done, you come back into our imaging room. Um, we make you nice and comfy again, and we take another image of your heart at that point. So we're looking at blood flow to your heart at rest and stress. And if you were having a blood flow uh, study, we would just do all of the uh, images, um, the injecting of the radio tracers and the pharmacologic stress agent while you're under the camera. So, and we're in there talking to you the whole time, making sure that you're very comfortable and that you're understanding everything that we're doing for you.